There you are. I had to bribe the concierge. I was frightened you might have gone. Did you find your handbag? No. It seems to be lost. What happened? Oh, you know. Just thinking it over. Where are you going? I have to go. Why? Business. I have business in Wren. Were you sloping off? Uh, not really. Well, yes. Being tactful. They want you. Good. Then I'll stay. I married early. I see. I was influenced by people I knew, contemporaries. Friends who seem to make a mess of their lives. I don't like mess. Promiscuity. I wanted to avoid the awful sloppiness people get into. Friends from school became hippies. No shape to their lives. A lot of us now are tired of all the old excuses. Just get on with things. It's been far too much living off the state. People get soft. They always think there's someone who'll solve their problems for them. I hate that soft. I see. People must make their own decisions. If you do something, you must live with the consequences. Goodness. Is that what you do? Don't you agree? It sounds very harsh. You're not like that. Aren't I? No, I don't think so. Or if you are, you have another side. Do I? Yes, I think so. I've seen it. You've shown it to me. <laughs> Why are you smiling? You're my first naked Tory. <laughs> and you? Do you have two sides to you? I change according to who I'm with. And with me? I'm not telling you yet. What's that you do? What? That. Don't you like it? Again. Is that what you feel? Huh? Not being free. Not being able to go off on your own. I always have. Oh, you're laughing. 
I'm not happy. So. What is? I was in the audience. Loyal admirer. I brought you this. I've given it up. I bought another. I couldn't phone you because of Gerald. It's been torture. I've missed you. Oh, really? It's wonderful to see you. How did you get in? I read about your ex-partner. God, yes, it was awful. They fished him out of the Seine. That's right. I see now why you were so hysterical that night. Do you know where the police found the bag? On the Pont des Arts. It hadn't been stolen. It was handed in. Go on, say. Say what? Anything. Like what? React. How extraordinary. I didn't go that way. Well, I didn't. Quick, quicker, Clara. Think up a new lie. Improvise. You're meant to be smart. You've committed a crime, insulting the intelligence. It ought to carry ten years. Look. All right, I'll tell you. How much do you know? I honestly believe this man Swanton was following me. He'd been trying to blackmail me, or so I thought. I was terrified. There'd been these calls. I tipped him over. It was an impulse. I so wanted to tell you before. Look, my darling, it was crazy, I admitted. Can't imagine what I've been through. I'm not a killer. I won't kill again. I made an honest mistake, for which I'm always going to suffer. Inside? Yes. Isn't inside enough? What you say about murder is what makes you so English. Now, you told me once people should answer for their actions, whether they speak in a posh voice or not. Wallace, what do you say? You haven't been to the police. Well, think about it. The whole thing's over. There were no witnesses. I have a son. Think what would happen to him if I went to prison. And Gerald, he's not a bad man. He just got in a mess financially and he chose a silly way out. These things happen. That's all. And you? Why should you be justice? Why should it be you who weighs these things in the scales? It's not right. You'd always be sorry. Bury it. Honestly, you must. You're corrupt. You have no character. Words come out. But there's nothing in you. It isn't true. You're lost if there's no agenda. And there's no agenda tonight. It's not true. Why do you think I came to your flat in the middle of the night after I killed him? I came because I needed you. It was the most terrible risk. I came because I loved you. Don't be ridiculous. I didn't know. Not then. You just needed company. Yes. At the start. I needed help. But later, no, it was real. I came to find you because I wanted to be sure. I've been used. You can't use people. No, no, no! Wallace! Uh, Wallace! Uh, please! Let go please. of me! Please! Don't go. Please. I'll care for you, I promise. There is a different side. That's what you once said, don't you remember? The side of me that's decent. You said it. Remember. Please. 
Please look at me, darling. Can't you see? Look into my eyes. How can I be lying? That whole side of me is bound up in you. You know there's some good. You know that there's good in me. I've been offered a job. Where? In Burma. They need my light fittings. <laughs> Answer it, please. Yes, who is it? Hello. It's a man. Stop calling me. I told you, stop calling me. Will you never leave me alone? We'll drive together to London. When we get there, we'll tell Gerald everything. But Clara, you must tell him what you did. I will. And about us. He wants a divorce just as much as I do. Wallace? Time to be honest. If we're honest, we can make a fresh start. I know, I'm sorry. Parliamentary business. Can't tell you what. Do you think you could take care of the boy? When will you be back? Clara will be back in the morning.
want me with you. No, I'm just wait here. You killed Swanton. Gerald. You're having an affair. Listen. You think you can get away with anything. No regard for anyone's feelings but your own. You're trash. You're just trash. You're human trash. And trash belongs in the dustbin. <gasps> you stupid man. You big stupid man. Why did you write him a letter putting the figures down? How could you? How could you do anything so incredibly stupid? Because that's what I'm like. I'm weak, and I don't think of the consequences. 